Hi, this is Harold Harb, and today we're going to look at two different kinds of short turns. One is a short, snappy turn, where the tails of the skis never go down to the fall line more than 45 degrees. That means you've got to lay up the edges and get enough pressure under the ski to suck your legs up and roll them over to the new turn. And a carved short turn that is rounded out and snaps with a good release. Here I'm demonstrating what we call flappers, which is a quick pullback move of the feet to raise the tails off the snow to make sure you can pull your feet back to get forward. This leads right into what we call dolphin turns, and this assures you that you can get a really strong pullback move and get onto the tips of your skis even on the steepest, iciest snow. Notice that the tails of the skis never drop down to perpendicular to the fall line. They constantly stay at 45 degrees to the fall line from turn to turn. And that the releases allow through the bottom of the turn the movement of the feet forward and the skis forward through the turn and then they're gathered up again and pulled back to get the tip engaged for the new turn. Here I demonstrate a carved short turn, which is a different approach. The skis come all the way around the circle, and then the release is done and made when the skis are closer to the fall line, directly into the fall line, closer to 90 degrees to the fall line, because this is a fully rounded out turn, like a C, half a, half a circle. Also notice that the feet are pulled back, and the ski tips are engaged at the top of the radius, very up, very high in the high C part of the turn.